initiating brainwave migration between the transplant and the host. Mnemonic activity coming from the transplant. It's degenerated, but it's there. We're going to load you into the strongest memories we can find. They might not be stable. Just hold on. Can you hear me? Ah, good. The simulation appears to be working, although the memories are quite fragmentary. I'll try to step you through the intact memories and hope we find one that gives us some clue to the Institute's location. There. This is the earliest intact memory I can find. Mom knew how it was. She wasn't soft, but uh, Remember, she loved me. You are experiencing these I was such a dummy scalp. back then. This may prove what did I know about how the world first. worked? I think now she this wanted me to kill her. To I should have. Instead, there to be I ended up running away. Memory close to you in I told myself I wanted to find somewhere there. out from under the thumb of the NCR and all their rules. But really, I was running from the guilt of not protecting her. The thing about happiness is, is you only know yet. Whatever made me think that a guy like me Let's should have thinking. a daughter? I'll connect you to the next intact no, memory. I, I never deserved her. Not for one second. How did you think this was going to end, Kellogg? <laughs> you thought you could just fuck with us, and we wouldn't fuck with you? Just so you know, they died like dogs. And you weren't there to I help them. I found another memory to try. I'll connect you. Mind if we... There's always someone who wanted someone else dead. Sometimes just roughed up, but uh, dead was usually what... I don't remember much from that time. It all kind of... We seem to be getting blends closer. together. Try this next one. <laughs> there was almost always a bar, though. That's universal. Mr. Kellogg, I'm glad you decided to meet with me. I finally ended up in the Commonwealth. I kind of ran out of road. Plus, I'd come to terms with life. I wasn't going to be stupid enough to get mixed up with caring about other people again. You heard all sorts of rumors about the Institute. One of these has got to tell us something. But I figured they were, we're just a convenient boogeyman for anything uh, bad that ever happened. Ah, there's one that looks mostly intact. They were real, all Connecting right. Connecting now. They didn't know anything about operating on the surface. Manual override initiated. Cryogenic stasis. Big heads never like taking orders from a dirty, contaminated degenerate like me. But they needed me. And I made sure they knew it. I never knew why we didn't just refreeze the rest of them. But we had our orders. <laughs> the eggheads never liked taking orders from a found dirty, contaminated memory. degenerate like me. But they needed me. And I made you. Is that your son? This wasn't my to be idea to settle memory. down with the kid in the middle of Diamond news, City. I, <laughs> I thought it was a terrible idea. This whole setup in Diamond City was part of some elaborate plan of the old man's. 
Seems obvious now that we were bait for our friend from the vault. It wasn't my idea to settle down with the kid in the middle of Diamond City. <laughs> I thought it was a terrible idea, actually. But it was one of the old man's pet projects, so here we were. Me and the kid, like a happy little family. I ended up kind of liking it. A reminder of what my life might have been if things had turned out differently. But there's no going back. I knew it was just temporary. It'd be back to normal business before too long. It wasn't my idea to settle down with the kid in the middle of Diamond City. <laughs> I thought it was a terrible idea, actually. But it was one of the old man's pet projects, so here we were. Me and the kid, like a happy little family. I ended up kind of liking it. Computers are still working. That's good. Checking through the logs. Hopefully it's all... Just find it. C6. Kellogg. It's okay. One of these days you're gonna get your head blown off just barging in here like that. Minimizing my exposure. The new breed of synths could easily pass as human. Some of them did. But the Coursers, they weren't built to blend in. They were killing machines, pure and simple. Smarter, stronger, and faster than almost any real human. I'm just glad they were always on my side. To civilians is a priority. Forget I said anything. So what's the big crisis this time? New orders for you. One of our scientists has left the Institute. Left? As in? He's gone rogue. Name's Dr. Brian Virgil. We know he's hiding somewhere in the glowing sea. Here's his file. Wow. Some heads are gonna roll for this. Capture and return, or just elimination? Elimination. He was working on a highly classified program. No kidding. One of the top bioscience boys? Damn. So, I guess you're taking the kid back with you. Affirmative. Your only mission is to locate and eliminate Virgil. You're taking me home to my father? Yes. Stand next to me and hold still. Okay. The dreaming. X688. Ready to relay with Sean. Bye, Mr. Kellogg. I hope I see you again soon. Bye. Teleportation. Now it all makes sense. Nobody's found the entrance to the Institute. Because there is no entrance. Let me pull you out of there. As soon as you're ready. you might have had. No one's ever done it. Forget about how much I care for you. I'm okay, doctor. Thank you. That's good. But I want you to keep monitoring yourself. We have to be sure there's no long-term damage. Are you 
Ready to talk about what happened in there? We got what we needed. The Institute uses teleportation to get in and out. Yes, their greatest secret has finally been revealed. But that only leads to more questions. How does it work? Where do we go next? That scientist Kellogg was supposed to track down. Virgil. We need to find him. You're right. A rogue Institute scientist could answer all kinds of questions. Where did the memory say he was? The glowing sea? That doesn't make sense. No one goes there. Not even if they were desperate. If we need to find Virgil, then I'm going after him. If you're going to go, be prepared. You'll need some way to combat the radiation there. It's called the Glowing Sea for a reason. How do I fight that much radiation, Doctor? There are chemical compounds. Radex, Radaway. You'd need as much as you could carry. Maybe more. A sealed environment suit would be great if you could find one. Or maybe one of those suits of power armor? That would be perfect. Oh, I'm going in naked. Fingers crossed I get superpowers. I know you're joking, but as a doctor, I feel obligated to remind you that unprotected radioactive exposure will only kill you. Dead. D-E-A-D. -E so be sure you find a way to get through there with your life intact. And good luck. By the way, I unplugged Mr. Valentine for you. Removed the implant while you were waking up. He's waiting for you upstairs. Hey, Valentine. Hope you got what you were looking for inside my head.
Stop right there, stranger. You approach Atom's holy ground. Why? State your purpose or be divided in his sight. I'm here because I need your help. Do you seek division? Have you cut down his followers? I'm looking for someone named Virgil. Virgil? Yes, we know this Virgil. What do you want with him? I need his help reaching the Institute. I have heard of this Institute. They hide themselves, trying to avoid the power of Adam. A futile effort. In truth, this Virgil has caused some concern. Some believe his presence is an affront to Adam. Though he came to trade with us on a few occasions, we have had little other contact with him. It was quite clear he wanted to be left alone. You can find him southwest of the crater, living in a cave. I would approach cautiously were I you. I feel he does not want visitors.
or be divided in his sight. I'm here because I need your help. Do you seek division? Have you come to merge with Atom, to be split in his infinite glory? Or do you seek to tear down his followers? I'm looking for someone named Virgil. Virgil? Yes, we know this Virgil. I need to speak with you. What do you need of me, child? I'm looking for someone named Virgil. Have you seen him? Yes, I know of him. What do you want with him? I need his help reaching the Institute. I have heard of this Institute. They hide themselves, trying to avoid the power of Adam. A futile effort. In truth, this Virgil has caused some concern. Some believe his presence is an affront to Adam. Though he came to trade with us on a few occasions, we have had little other contact with him. It was quite clear he wanted to be left alone. You can find him southwest of the crater, living in a cave. I would approach cautiously were I you. I feel he does not want visitors.
nice and slow. No sudden moves. I know you're from the Institute. So where's Kellogg, huh? Trying to sneak up on me while you distract me? It's not going to work. I'm not stupid. I knew they'd send him after me. Take it easy. Kellogg's dead. Dead? He's dead. Don't you lie to me. I'm not lying. I killed him myself. Did you? Kellogg was ruthless. There's a reason the Institute used him to do their dirty work for so many years. I knew they'd send him after me. Tried to prepare for it. But I still wasn't sure I'd make it. And so you... You killed him, eh? Then what do you want with me? I know you were part of it. And you escaped. They sent Kellogg to kill you. How the hell do you know any of that? No, it doesn't matter. I'm not going back. I can't go back. Look at me. Why are you even here? What do you want? Relax. I just need to know how to get in there. Wait, what? Are you serious? You want to get into the Institute? Are you insane? Never mind how nearly impossible that is. Even if you were to succeed, it'd almost certainly end in your immediate death. What reason could you possibly have for taking that kind of risk? I'm trying to find my son. The Institute kidnapped him. Oh. Oh no. I had no idea. I'm sorry. Yeah. The Institute has taken people from the Commonwealth in the past. If your son is one of them, I can understand why you'd want to get in there. I can help, but I'm going to need something in return. You help me, and I'll help you. All right. If I help you, you're going to do something for me. Before I was forced to leave, I was working on a serum to reverse this mutation. It could return me to normal. You understand? So if you get in there, I need you to find it in my old office and bring it to me. I think that's pretty reasonable in exchange for helping you. All right, let's talk details. First things first, you know how synths get in and out of the Institute? Yeah, they use some sort of teleporter. Well, well, not many know about it. Pretty closely guarded secret. You've certainly done your homework. It's commonly referred to as the Molecular Relay. I don't understand all the science behind it, but it works. Dematerializes you in one place, rematerializes you in another. I'm sure it sounds crazy, but it's a reality. The Relay is the only... That means you're going to have to use it. Now, have you ever seen an Institute courser? I don't really know, but it doesn't sound familiar. Not surprising. They don't come out often, and when they do, few see them. Coursers are Institute synths designed for one purpose. They're hunters. Operations go wrong, a synth goes missing, and a courser is dispatched. They're very good at what they do, and you're going to have to kill one. Let's go. Just point me in the right direction. Well, I suppose your enthusiasm counts for something. Every courser has special hardware that gives them a direct connection to the relay in the Institute. It's embedded in a chip in their heads. You need that chip. But to get it, you'll have to find a courser. Now, I don't know exactly where you can find one. They haven't sent any after me. And sitting here waiting doesn't seem like a good plan. You're going to have to hunt one down. I can tell you where to start and give you some help finding one. But you'll have to do the dirty work. Okay. Let's get to work. Right. The primary insertion point for coursers 
is in the ruins of CIT, directly above the Institute. So you'll want to head there. Now, the relay causes some pretty heavy interference all across the EM spectrum. You've got a radio on that pip boy, right? When you get to the ruins, tune it to the lower end of the band and listen in. You'll be able to hear the interference. Follow the signal, and it'll lead you to a courser. Then, you just have to not get killed. Not gonna lie, the odds aren't in your favor here. But if you do make it, remember what I said about the serum. I need it badly. I... I really do hope you find what you're looking for.